Hey, Shad here with Speed Addicts, the fastest growing gear site on the web. And today we're gonna uncrate this Cortec bender flannel. What's up, SpeedX fan? Before we jump in and give you the rundown on this Cortec riding flannel, do us both a fa favor, subscribe to that Speed Addicts channel. I'll wait, only oh, takes a click. Okay, thank you. Now you're not gonna miss out on any of the latest gear coming your way. We're gonna educate you and give you that first look. So we do appreciate that. Also, if you'd like to support us here at speedaddicts.com, you can do so by simply shopping with us. Don't give your money to those corporate monoliths. Support an independent company like Speed Addicts. You can do so by hitting that link in the description below. It'll take you right over to this Cortec riding flannel at Speed Addicts. While you're over there, feel free to shop for any of the parts or gear you might need for your next two wheel adventure. Okay, so riding flannels have become more popular over the past decade or so. And basically think of it as a motorcycle jacket that doesn't look like one. Now. It's not quite as protective, honestly, uh, as a, um, a purpose-built either textile or leather riding jacket, but it's better than nothing. It's going to have armor. Uh, it could have armor. This one does, has armor in the elbows and the shoulders and an optional back protector, as well as being reinforced for the slide with abrasion-resistant material that could be anything from a Cordura sewn in or some sort of mesh material or even Kevlar like this one has in the elbows and shoulders. So more on that later, but suffice to say, if you want a more casual look, especially when you're off the bike, then your typical riding jacket, riding flannel might be a cool option here. So the Bender riding jacket from Cortex is gonna go for $129. It comes in different color, ways, and sizing, small through three extra large. Now, it does run true according to the sizing chart, but I think the sizing chart kind of skews a little small. So most size larges in, this, in the motorcycle industry are usually around a 44 inch chest, which is what I am. Um, not in the bender. The bender large starts at 42. So I'm wearing a large and I really should be in an extra large. I'm 6'2", 220, and a 44 inch chest. Hopefully that helps you out. But all you have to remember is go by the Cortex sizing chart it is accurate. So get a chest measurement and I'll give you a good idea of what size to order. Now, when you're shopping for gear online, you're worried about fit. You should really shop with Speed Addicts because we're gonna have you covered with no cost returns. That means you're not gonna pay for that return shipping label. That's on us. We don't nickel and dime you like those other people. You know who I'm talking about. You're gonna get treated like family, really easy return process, get a different color, different size. Whatever you need to do, we make it real simple. Okay, back to the riding flannel. So the outer layer is 100% cotton. It feels like any other flannel you have in your closet. It's not like too stiff or hard or anything like that. So the protective layers are beneath this 100% cotton layer. Inside, what's doing the abrasion resistant is this mesh liner down below. So this is the same sort of mesh that you'd see in a mesh riding jacket. So this is abrasion resistant synchro mesh, high density abrasion resistant stuff. Now. They've gone one above that in uh, certain areas, in the elbow and shoulder areas, which is typically where you would slide in case of a get off there. And there they've gone with true genuine DuPont Kevlar in those elbow and shoulder areas. Now you're going to get armor. And this is CE level one armor in the elbows and in the shoulders. The armor is currently installed in the jacket. And one of the reasons this thing's kind of skews small, right? So normally I can get away the large in most jackets, but this one, especially with the armor, maybe if I wasn't gonna run the elbow and shoulder armor and just wear the flannel, I can get away with the large, but you kinda get the point there. So the armor is installed, it can be removed when you go to wash it. And the back protector I don't have currently installed, just so you can see what it looks like without the back protector in it. It's sold separately and it fits in a pocket that's ready for you in the back there. Let's check out a few of the zipper snaps and pockets. I guess we'll start with the underarm ventilation. So on both armpits, you have a zippered uh, ventilation system. So you can unzip that and get a little bit more airflow. This thing's not super warm, especially when you're riding. When you're off the bike, you know, kind of feel like most flannels. But when you're riding, you know, flannel cotton material doesn't hold back a lot of wind. And the interior is this mesh material. So it's gonna flow pretty good. It's not great for you know cold temps. You're probably gonna want something a little bit more robust, but mild to warm temps, this is dialed in. Again, you got the armpit uh, zippers there if you wanna flow a little bit more air. You got two snap pockets here for your Marlboros. You're ready to go. 
down on the cuffs, you get a snap and a Velcro. So you can easily kind of pop this up. If you want to roll that back when you're off the bike or you're just trying to fit it over your glove. So they've gone with Velcro and a snap on both uh, cuffs there. YKK zipper on this primary zipper and then you get snaps to button this down here. In terms of the storage on the inside, you got a pretty good options here. So on your right side, you have a concealed carry pocket right here and it is pretty good size. Uh, there are no elastic bands, holsters or anything else to hold a weapon in place, uh, but it is rather large and could fit uh, most concealed carry options for you should you be choosing to uh, exercise your second amendment. Inside you also have the zipper pocket right here which is pretty large and then you get a slash zipper pocket on your right side. So you have a fair amount of storage, you've got armor, you got Kevlar in the elbows, pretty solid flannel. Just remember don't just order a large because you normally order a large. Check the size and chart, take a quick measurement and it'll save you some time when you're trying to find one of these Cortec bender flannels that will suit you best. Two, two year warranty from Cortec, which is great. It's about a year longer than most of the brands kind of at this price point when it comes to riding flannels. And that's all I got for you. If you still have questions, head over to speedx.com and talk to one of our experts on the rider support team. You can actually talk to a human over there by phone, email, or live chat. And if you got a Cortec bender flannel, sound off in the comment section below. Never just take my word for it. That's it for today, folks. We'll see you next time to find out what's in the crate.